And God saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and every imagination of the thoughts of his heart, was only evil continually, and the Lord repented that he made man on the earth, and it grieved him in his heart. And God said, I will destroy man whom I have created from the face of the earth, both man, beast, and creeping thing, and the birds of the air, for it repenteth me that I made them. But Noah, found grace in God's eyes. He was a righteous man, and he walked with God. And Noah had three sons, Ham, Shem, and Japheth, and they were all married. Which makes eight people in Noah's family. One day, God spoke to Noah. Noah? Noah, the end of all flesh has come before me, because the earth is filled with violence. You, will make an ark out of gopher wood. You will make rooms in the ark, and pitch it within, and without, with pitch, and these are the measurements of the ark. 300 cubits in length, 50 cubits wide, 30 cubits high. By today's standards, that would mean, 450 feet in length, 75 feet wide, and 45 feet high. And Noah continued to build the ark as the years passed, and people were beginning to take notice. What's his problem? Is he crazy? That old man was building that thing since I was a baby. I don't get it. Years passed, decades passed, even centuries passed, and Noah never stopped working. Soon, the animals were entering the ark, two of every sort, male and female. And God said, Noah, come into the ark, you, and your household, because I have seen that you are righteous before me, in this generation. And so, Noah, his wife and three sons, and his sons' wives, entered the ark, and the Lord, shut them, in. Noah was six hundred years old, when the flood came. Interesting weather we're having. I'm sure it'll blow over soon. You got that right, I'm getting married tomorrow. Hey, what's this web stuff called? I forgot. It's called, rain. You're 368 years old. You should know that by now. In the second month, the 17th day of the month, the fountains of the great deep were broken up, and the windows of heaven, were opened. The rains fell, 40 days and 40 nights, and every living thing on the earth, died. Only Noah, his family, and the animals that were with them, were safe. After the forty days and forty nights passed, the rain stopped, and the waters receded, and the ark rested upon the mountains of Ararat. Noah, sent out a raven, and then, he sent a dove, to see how fast the waters were going down. And it came to pass, in the six hundredth and first year, in the first day of the first month, the waters were dry, and Noah, and his family, built an altar, unto the Lord.